Hello everyone, today we'll be playing Rec Room, Quick Shift. Sorry if I haven't been uploading in a long time, but because I was kind of busy. So we're going to play a horror game. It's, it's not really that horrifying, but it's supposed to be scary. It's like more Halloween themed, so I thought we should play a game like this. There's nobody here. I put a private because I don't remember people play this still. This kind of... It's actually really old. It's not in the highlights. It used to be like a very popular game. But we're going to do Shift 1. I played most of the mini games. I just haven't really played the Shift. So hopefully we can play the Shift. If... Now if it does... This is only... I don't know if it's going to work for... Um... Screen. But we're going to try. So we're going to try... <clears throat> hello, hello. Oh, there we go. Hey, Jacob. How you doing? It's me, Ron. You know, the guy who kind of uh, applied you to this job. All right. So for some reason, the phone in the office can only record 33 seconds long messages, or around that time anyways, so I'm going to have to cut these messages short, so uh, the audio sounds very weird, I'm sorry there. about that, but, oh, oh well, as long as you get the instructions right, that's what matters, alright. Oh, and also, I'm recording this, uh, not on the phone, but in a headset, in the uh, rec recording office, you know, with all the sounds and the equipment for the restaurant, alright, but anyways, so, as you know, you're working in a child and adult supported entertainment uh, restaurant with, you know, a play place, animatronics, yeah, you already knew that, but I just have to remind you because I know you, Jacob, you forget a lot of things. Is that good or bad animatronics? No, most of the animatronics are in shutdown on the stage. More, but I wait, left certain more. ones on for certain reasons, mostly because uh, guarding things and just to save energy to keep the place safe, blah blah blah, stupid reasons. Yeah, 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 you get it. From but the gardening. here's the thing, most of them that will appear in your office, yes, they will appear in your office, they explore the entire building multiple times, so they're eventually going to end up in your office, not guaranteed, but still. Oh, got a switch. As I was saying, most of them are completely harmless, but uh, a certain amount of them can actually, like, hurt you real badly. Maybe even kill you. But of course, you did sign the paper that, you know, advises that you could die from this job, right? <sighs> okay. Because huh. there's no way out of here until uh, three hours have passed. Yeah, your shift is pretty quick, it's only three hours. But, um,. There's a bit of equipment that you can use to, you know, keep yourself safe. Oh, shoot, I got a switch. As I was saying, to defend yourself from the hostile entities, or animatronics, I guess you could say, that may wander into your office. So, let me get started on that, and I'll explain more about the animatronics later. Now, you have a red button that can toggle the light behind you to see if anything's coming from there. Where? While the green button can turn on the lights into the hallway that leads into the kids section in front of you uh, just to see you know if there's anything there and to uh, make yourself panic if you do see it uh, <laughs> oh, that's just a joke by the way but um yeah then there's also this purple glowing button and okay let me explain there's this What's his name again? Give me a sec, I gotta look at the papers. Ah, yes. Bon Zowie. He has a weird name. He's like uh, this clown joker, whatever the hell he is. Uh, uh he's huh? very, very hyper and excited, uh, so he'll wander into your office, and he'll okay. jam your door shut. So just click the purple glowing button to zap him and get rid of him. Now, uh, the door shut, uh, or jammed, may not seem much, but the, uh, the other one, uh, or for the next button, the blue button, what? that looks a bit more <laughs> fancy, can close the big metal door behind you, just to stop from uh, 
usually uh, certain different ones come from that area, but most of the time it's uh, bully, you Where know, bully go? over bull, and just close it uh, so he doesn't get in. She's back there. Oh wait. No, um, oh, there's a problem with the door. You can't just keep it closed because it also turns off the light toggle switch, which I'll explain with that this later. But the problem with uh, that is... We didn't already explain the problem? Oh yes, I did. Sorry about that. I'm getting off track here. But, um... I don't know why... We're probably gonna fix that in like three days I from mean... here. Even though you're not gonna be uh, here, you're only gonna do, be doing like three shifts. But anyways, as I was saying... Oh, the toggle light button. Basically, you can toggle the lights of your office. Now, that may be, like, useless, because, you know, it's already freaking terrifying into here. Just look how dark is. Weird kid robots, you know, coming to visit you and potentially harm you. Probably not kill you, but still. Um, basically, there's this... We call him Flame. He doesn't really have a real name. We call him Flame uh -huh. because he has, like, burnt metal pieces that aren't cooling down, and they glow in the dark. Yeah. Uh... Uh, he's he usually appears from the front hall. Nobody else apart from uh, uh, that clown thing, whatever the hell it is. Um, he'll usually appear from there. But the thing is, his endoskeleton is very, very based off of the original Fazbear's location. So it has this thing called the cloak and decloak. It can turn invisible, he, or he can turn invisible when he wants, so he'll appear at any time, usually. That's what happened to the last guard. Just turn off your lights and turn it back on to get rid of him. To get rid of him. But I, that, I know that sounds unrealistic, but for some reason, um, he can, like, make visible photons just go right through him. That should be scientifically impossible, but whatever. Uh, but, um... Yeah, I don't know why. It's probably because um, we're trying to get better technology. Sure, AIs or our animatronics are very high advanced. We want okay, we want to get them higher advanced. So we're studying the endoskeletons. So that's a field project. And then you have your you know regular flashlight. Um, it does. It's not very you know good because it doesn't like the visible light uh, doesn't travel too far. It's very weak flashlight, but uh, the thing is, we have to save energy. But apart from that, you can use it to look around. Oh, speaking of which, I forgot to mention one other animatronic. Sorry about that. Oh, wait, what? Not mentioning, uh, I was mentioning buttons, not animatronics, but we need to look at. But anyways, um, if you... Take your flashlight and point oh. it to okay, the green ones, the right one that in the middle of back and right. Oh, oh, you'll find Vanessa. Yeah, she's she's work in progress. For some reason, the artists haven't came to, you know, uh, put the uh, plastic and rubber skin and, you know, uh, the paint to, you know, make her a bit more friendly looking. Uh, but uh, the reason she's in here, I, I forget. I'll have to go ask my boss. There's okay. no stopping whatever she does. Okay, but don't worry, she's, she's completely harmless. In Can fact, you, she'll okay. actually help you by, I don't know, lighting up the place with her very, okay, very go good flashlight eyes. Or keep you company because this place is scary as all living hell. Thank you. Now, that's everything, though I need to explain a couple other things. Okay, so, go on. Yeah, let me just... I think I just keep paper, pressing that on him. I'll keep reading. Is there anybody else though? Oh god. And so though I wasn't reading this entire thing, it, I had to read like, like near a certain subject, so the paper gave me so topics on what to talk about and teach oh, god. Okay, god. Now, uh, as you heard me earlier, yes, this shift is only three hours. It's three not hours? too long for a night shift, uh, but um, it feels you also, you also talking. get paid pretty well, honestly. Got you. Get, like, how much is it? Oh, yeah, it's $250 per shift. Yeah, that's a lot oh. of money. But that's because all the other guys. Uh, 
Now she has not a lot of money. Got way too scared and, you know, you. never decided to come back. Well, yeah. I, was, I wasn't gonna say that we're gonna die. The chances of that happening are very low, like you said. If you're skilled, maybe it'll even be uh, zero. I mean, it's pretty easy to operate all of this, and um, I don't recommend... Um, I don't recommend going to the third shift. I, I understand if you don't want to go in the third shift. Uh, usually on uh, Fridays, it gets really weird. Alright, I've at least talked for like... <laughs> Uh, a bit more than five minutes. Yeah, that's so, good, yeah. good. Alright. That's fine. Good luck. Don't die. And that's just hard be safe, alright? And also don't... Oh. Don't... Uh, oh, do crap. ...things at the what animatronics. They're very delicate. They're, they're only literally made uh, of plastic. I didn't know what to press. Shoot. I can hear it still. Okay, that was good. Uh. Okay, so we're gonna do that again. If we do that again, we're gonna have to. Okay. How do we defeat him, though? Ding! I didn't. Was it listening fully? Oh yeah, that's gonna be for like another episode, probably though. If I play this more, thinking too. Okay, so I'm gonna look at who we were gonna have, the who was going after us. Okay, so we got you, you bullied the, the guy that was in the back. You were the thing that kept coming in. And you're the thing that was like right in front of us. I don't know how to get rid of him though. What's that? Oh, okay, no, I, see, I thought it was like a little cold or something. Oh yeah, I can get up on them. Yeah, these are some of the other animatronics. I don't know who Winter is. We might have to play a few of the other shifts, but let's play a mini game one. Holloway March. I don't know what this is. We can play this with something else. This or a, a combine the shifts. We could try the next time to shift again. I might search online, see if there's anything, or figure it out myself. Uh, this is pitch dark. Oh, wait a minute. This is like, um, I don't know if an FBR is like a Halloween thing for the view. And there will be like the doors and they will be coming out of. Oh, crap. Oh, God. Are you gonna... I don't see. Go, 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 go. So open, he's so open. These are, uh, but this is like a. Please, please, we can get past them, please. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. Please, there won't be saying a door in the dark. Okay, let's keep running. We're gonna make it, we're gonna make it, we're gonna make it, we're gonna make it. Mm. I s okay. Okay, I think we're good. I think w if this is that, it's I shouldn't say anything. Okay, keep going, just keep going, sorry. I can't look back, just in case. Oh! That isn't that hard, dude. It's a really easy thing. Okay, I think I might end the video here. I know it's very short, but at least we got to see the game. It's like an introduction into the game. We got to see how hard it is, and that's only the normal shift. There's the, ver I think the hellish versions of it, and, and stuff. So we're gonna, this is gonna be the end of the video, so goodbye.